Hello, this is Bern, and on today's episode, I'm going to be sharing with you two of the most important decisions you need to make consistently if you want to step into the most fulfilling and long-lasting relationship with a man. So stick with me. Hello, this is Bern. Welcome to your greatlifetv.com, a space where I share with ambitious, conscious, heart-centered, and successful women how you can create the relationship of your dreams as a result of stepping into the most alive, high value and feminine version of you without the need for stupid gimmicks, manipulation or crazy tricks. <laughs> Today's topic is of so much importance because I find so many women and so many men in today's world who are unable to create a long-term relationship and the two most important decisions that are preventing so many humans from experiencing that are this. The first one is, it's like they don't touch basically. These are, you have one or the other. The first one is, do you want instant pleasure? If the answer to that is yes, the cost or the price to pay for instant pleasure is long-term pain for the most part. I'm sure you can be smart, smart aleck and find some exception to this rule, but for the most part, instant pleasure will typically mean that you're suffering long-term, right? if it's just instant pleasure that you're going for. The second decision is, do you want to go through short-term growth, short-term discomfort, short-term investment into something that may not feel fulfilling at the moment, but it's planting the seeds for something greater that has room to grow unendingly. So here's the thing that happens. Short-term pleasure, have sex with a guy the first time you connect with him. Short-term pleasure, just watch the movie without asking him what is he looking for in a relationship. Short-term pleasure, don't reveal much about yourself so he gets this fake idea of who you are instead of who you really are because if he gets who you really are, he can reject you. If he doesn't get what you really are, he can't. It's more fun, but it's planting the seeds for potential explosions, nuclear explosions in the future, right? Now, short-term investment, say no to having sex with him early on. You have no idea who he is, say no to even making out with a dude that you, you're not sure who he is. Uh, say no to the date where you have no clear idea what he's searching for in, in life or in a relationship. Uh, it's more uncomfortable to ask the question, right? It takes more courage to say, before we go on a date, let me know more about yourself. Tell me what you're looking for in a relationship. Why? Because if you ask that question, he can reject you. If you don't ask that question, you can enter that time, the spacing of the date and find out one hour later that he's a total time waster and that now you have even more feelings of pain towards dating which is just fucking up your chances in the future so there you have it if you want to create the type of relationship you want you need to be willing to distinguish short-term versus long-term fulfillment pleasure now a lot of human beings feel that the purpose of a relationship is pleasure and that is not the purpose of a relationship. That's one of the side effects of a relationship, but it's not the source and it's not the why of a relationship. It's not the reasoning behind entering a relationship. You want to enter a relationship because you want to be the best version of yourself, because you want to give what's in your heart to give, not die without having your gift be exposed and given, because you want to experience the depth of commitment and devotion, because you want to become a source of light between you and that man and have both of you shine stronger into the world than either one of you could have done individually, no matter how awesome you both are individually. You want to do it for so many reasons, including experiencing more pleasure. But when you define the relationship fundamentally as a way to feel your pleasurable needs, the thing that you risk and the thing that you put in complete jeopardy is the future that's sustainable and fulfilling the future that is filled with meaning, the future that is filled with real sustainable hope, the future that is an example for others to follow. So choose wisely and choose carefully. You do have to have a balance. It's not just about sacrifice. It's not just about short-term discomfort. It is mainly about figuring out what you want and answering this question. What is the price I must pay today, right now, to be able to get it versus what do I want to experience right now? What you want to experience right now and what you need to experience right now are many times two different things. And you need to know the difference because if you do it right, if you're willing to have more discipline short term, if you're willing to ask better questions, if you're willing to set higher standards, if you're willing to say no or fuck no when you need to, meaning being really strong about your no, and if you, if you can hold that view, openness but boundaries, it's more challenging, it's less fun in the short term, 
but it gets you the kind of relationship few people dream even to have. Hope this is helpful, useful, insightful to you. If it is, I'm going to ask you, my dear, to do three things. Number one, click like or thumbs up on this video. Number two, subscribe to my channel. And if you, if you subscribe, then hit the little bell so you can be notified of new episodes. Thing number three, and most important of all, two parts to thing number three. First thing is on the first link on the description of this video, you're going to find, um, if you click on it, you can enter your name and email and be immediately redirected to a masterclass I recorded for you that is going to give you a lot more insight into how you can step into the most fulfilling relationship with less pain. The second part is on the second link on the description of this video, you'll find a way to personally connect with me to find out if we might be a fit to work together. Uh, you apply, basically fill out a small application. If I feel I can help you, my assistant will reach out and connect with you. The reason why I share that is because for many of you, watching videos is not enough. And I'm not saying you have to work with me, I'm saying you, need, you might need to get some help to get exactly what you want without the extra 10 years of trying to figure it out on your own. Thank you so much for allowing me into your heart, into your home, for feeling my message, and more importantly than that, for stepping into the message because that's when you get the results that you want. Mwah.